this weekend we got the one uh, semi finals happening. What is it? Quarter, yeah. quarter finals is it called? Oh, yeah, uh, no, preliminary, preliminary finals. Preliminary finals. Okay. Um, we've got who's playing um, Manly versus, uh, sorry, Melbourne versus Panthers and yeah. Manly versus South Sydney. What's your tips? What do you, what do you think is going to happen? So, uh, just having reviewed, kind of looked at the seasons and looked at the last few weeks, Melbourne for me will win the comp. It's, it's hard for me to look at them not winning the comp. I just think. The way they're structured, the way that this whole kind of next man in have brought into their system has yeah. been absolutely amazing. Kind of what, similar to what Roosters did this year, um, mm-hmm. and just trying to survive and keep in the fold. But the Storm, every player that comes in just excels. It's not that yeah. they're, they're mediocre and they, as they grow, nah, it's they, they come in, it, media impact, you know? Yeah. Storm have been able to do that so well. And if you look at the two games where Melbourne beat Manly, the first one being 28 18 at Suncorp, and then the one 42 to 10 uh, uh, two weeks ago, you look at how Storm stopped Tom Chaboyevich. Mm. Because for me, mainly, their whole team is Tom Chaboyevich. You've seen mm. that all year. You saw them yeah. lose the four, yeah. first four weeks of the season. Yeah, they scraped through the fifth round, and Tommy Turbo comes back, and they, they, they finish the top four. Yeah. So for me, Melbourne, the way they isolated him and they continue to isolate those star players in those teams reminds me of when Storm did that to the Bulldogs in 2012 with Ben Barber. Yeah, 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 you yeah. Know, ben Barber lit the Storm up, you know, That's scored, right. set up that. You know, long range trial for Josh Morris, that very famous try back in 2012. Where every game Barber played, he killed it. Everything he did was heroic. So that when he came to the grand final, Melbourne just isolated him. And he was out pretty much our whole team. He stopped him, so, yeah. Yeah, so Melbourne will, will get over Panthers. I think the way Panthers have been playing has been very ordinary. They blew a few chances on the weekend, but I just think that Melbourne will have the upper hand and just put them put him away, and it'll be a lot easier this time around. Mm. And then in the second game, I'm, I'm actually back in the Rabbitohs. Oh, I think Rabbitohs have what it takes. Really? Yeah, yeah. Rabbitohs will get the job done over Manly. I just think that the Rabbitohs have enough experience there. Although they, they suffer with Black Taffy at fullback as opposed to the troll, I think ben has got something up his sleeve again. He's got something else to deliver them. They've been to three straight preliminary finals and haven't been able to go to the grand final. So I know Bennett has it up his arsenal to go and, and, and produce something big and, and he'll get it done over Manly. I, I just I think it'll be a storm and uh, Rabbitohs grand final. Oh, that's his call. Let's see Ray now. <laughs> What's you, Ray? What do you think? Well, I'm with Stat on the uh, the Melbourne side of things, mate. They are they are just another level. They're just not they're not in the same league, in my opinion. You look at that structure, you look at that system they've got there. They're they're going straight to the final. Panthers don't stand a chance, in my opinion. Um, they play a lot of backyard footy, so I think that is um, the big difference in that game. You got structured footy, backyard footy, structured footy is yeah. going to take it. Yeah. Um, but I think Manly is going to take it over. Um, rabbits, and I think the deciding factor there is Tom Turbo. Uh, mm. Just like Stat said, he changes that team entirely. I think the fact that Latrell is not in the team is going to have an impact on the uh, fullback challenge. So I think mm. it's going to be uh, Melbourne Manly, but Melbourne will take it at the end of the day. Ooh. 